in. It's... I think it's time. Boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if, if he doesn't? Kenny. I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. No. There's... Come on, cat. You think of one. You let me know. And there's some sort of pill or something we can just give him. Stop it. He can just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know, but we know it's here or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. I should, fuck. I, I, I can. I can do this. You can't. I love you, Ken, but this is beyond you. I'll do it. Oh, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and... Let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest? So Clementine doesn't have to see. a moment to say goodbye. Of course. I'm gonna take care of Doc. I thought he was going to die. I'm gonna make sure he's okay. I'm making sure he doesn't come back. Oh. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... Ow! Oh! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Oh, it'll be fine. Gotcha! Why? Cat? Honey? Oh, fucking God! <laughs> what the hell happened? What did you... She could... She... 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 Oh, fuck! Give me the gun, kid. 
I'll do it. Talk to my girl. Just stay away from her. Excuse me, son? I heard you told her she was gonna die. That she was gonna end up like Duck. Why'd you go and do that? Oh, she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? You find a boat. Think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. It were. You gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. I'm not a barber. You gotta be styled. Jesus. You gotta run around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack, and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun, because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Okay. Explain to her how they work, and not to be afraid. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job, but too many people have died already. They have. Seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. You got a few ideas. 
We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Be safe up here. You betcha. Good to get to the water. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure Cat would be uh, okay with you, so forget it. Okay. And if I could buy you for a second, Kitty. Can you just leave me alone? Hey, Ben. Hey. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. There aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you gonna be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. See you. Yeah. It's a fifth of whiskey. To him? Did. He had some, uh. He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. What should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little. So you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. Aim. You look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? Ready to shoot. Make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, I was a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay.
Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Okay, a little higher. Bit to the right. Steady now. Almost got it. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. to the left. Aim a little higher. There you go. Nice. I did it! Yeah, you did. Good job. I was holding my breath, and the gun didn't shake so much. See? You did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. My hands hurt, and my ears have noise in them. Like... You'll get used to it. What a crappy day. The crappiest. If three months ago I'd known what you'd be seeing, I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no. What happened? Nothing. We have to talk about your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. What? You saying it smells? No. Because it does. Kinda. You remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? Need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Mind if we do this now? Guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. to do this oh, no idea I'm not much of a stylist you know I'm going to look like a boy I think how much safer you'll be I'd rather be dead shush now so you did kill someone before yeah I'm glad you finally told me me too You've killed lots of things now. It doesn't even matter. Killing is bad no matter what. You do it now to protect yourself. And to protect me. Doesn't make it good. But you have to. I do it because it's necessary. Walkers aren't people. Okay, I think I'm about done. 
I can probably tear these pieces back with something. I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. There. All set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no. You look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Wanna nip? Nah, I'm fine. Suit yourself. Anybody in there want to share a drink, you let them know. Will do. and documents. There was a map of Savannah in the cab. That's where I would look. I'll talk it over with Clementine. Make sure she's got a sense of things by the time we arrive. Good. Be safe up here. You betcha. giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. Jesus, Ben. I know. He said they had my friend, that he was with them. Just, just stop. Even trust you. Yes. Why'd you have to go and tell me that? Just no. Just don't tell anybody. You can't take any of it back, so don't. Okay. You still want to talk to me? I don't have a lot of choice unless you're going somewhere. I. I guess I'm not. 
What are you doing out here? I, uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. Dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. See you. Yeah. Hey, Claire. Hi. Want to talk about Savannah? Me too. And what we're gonna do when we get there. We don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. Plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. Find my parents. We've come all this way. We have to. Okay. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh. Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There's a lot of hotels on here, but read this map and maybe it'll jog your memory. They've got really tasty desserts. It's called the M... M... something... Mar... Is this it? The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! So we'll head there. Yes! You think we have a good plan? I think it's very good. Can I... tell my parents? You know... Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? But better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little shot. Thanks. I guess we should see how far- Oh shit! Hold on, everybody! 